Hey. What's up? What's up, buddy? What's going on? What are you up to? Nothing. How are you doing? Good. Same, you know. Yeah. So, uh, what's new? How do you like, what's his name, going to the Lakers? Oh, I'm excited. Are you? It's been a while since they've been relevant, so. Yeah. You know? Yeah. I mean, I don't know how good they're going to be, but yeah. they got to get some more pieces. Yeah. Like Kawhi, you know? Kawhi, he'll go there, too? Yeah. Oh. But they, but the, San Antonio's I'm just sick of these players just jumping ship and like, oh, everyone's going to Golden State. Oh, that's yeah, that's, that's crazy. That's the way it is now. I know. There's like three, four good teams. Uh, the, yeah, I know. It's like, uh, I, w I actually want to, I'm not a LeBron fan because I'm a Jordan guy, but I, you know, he's the strongest and fastest player on the court every yeah, day, so yeah. he's going to do what he would get what he, yeah, you know, whenever he has the ball. He's dominant. Yeah, that's why. I mean, how come GMs aren't drafting Carl Malone's and Charles Barkley's now? I don't know if they're out there anymore. The type of player's kind of gone now. Are they? I yeah. just thought maybe. Everybody wants I to shoot just, threes. I know. Yeah, Even yeah, the big that's guys. Too, so you got to have speed. Yeah. Um, but I wanted to see him go to Philly because then it's right near his home in Cleveland that he wouldn't yeah. sell or can't sell for what it's worth. And it just because then you go to Philly, I mean, it's right up the road from where he lives, I thought. Well, yeah, If he absolutely. went there, it'd be cool. Thank you. And um, so that's about it. Now, um, were the Yankees better before Bird and that red-headed guy came back? Well, Frazier Fraser doesn't play at all. He needs to play more. Oh, he doesn't play. Okay. But, I haven't watched him since no. Bird came. Bird's, I just got Bird stinks. Why? He doesn't Bird, hit. I know. He's been 200. He's supposed to be. I thought Bird gives him too many home run hitters, so. I mean, but that's fine. Like, you can't hit 200. Right. He's got that's terrible. Th three homers and so five ribbies. Were they better? Who was the guy that was playing before he came back? Uh, were they better they're with Tyler him? Austin. Were they better with him, like, put yeah. the ball in play, less home yeah. runners? That's what I thought. It was like my kind of team. I always liked Bird, but then when he got out, they learned to win without him, so I didn't yeah. want to see him. And I hate a home run hitting team because look at the A's. You get to them 90, the 89 A's, 90s. You get to the playoffs, you can't hit home runs. Yeah. And then that happens. Yeah, and that's why game. I'm not a fan. I missed like the 96 team and then the National League style back in the 90s. Yeah, you know? but all the teams do that now. All right, I know, players. I hate it's, it. Those are homers. And everything sucks. Football's arena football. It's yeah, like, it's different now. I hate it. It's I just, different. Yeah, I know. I don't even watch much. It's like I try to watch NBA. I just never know what channel it's on and stuff like that. Yeah. I was, you know, so that's about it, you know. Yeah, yeah there's some good players. So I watch, you know, the Lakers are good, I'll be happy. So yeah. We'll see. Uh huh. You know, now I gotta get my Chargers to get a title before I die. Oh, right, you right. Know? Yeah, I'd love to see the next win one in my lifetime. But yeah. I don't care why you they're, you know, they're but another thing, my biggest argument is there's too many teams in the NBA, same for football, or no, basketball, NBA. And in the NFL, there's too many teams, so it's too flooded out. Oh, it's and then down. teams can't catch up to the good, great teams. Yeah. It's like, take the NFL, you subtract the newer Cleveland team, Jacksonville, Carolina, and there's one other new team. You take all them teams out and now let the existing teams draft those players. Yeah. And you got an NBA or an NFL oh, yeah, team that you had talent. in the 90s, early 90s, yeah. you know? That freaking expansion. Then the same with the NBA. You take those teams that came out in the mid 90s or later, like the well, Hornets and Orlando. Uh, Orlando. 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 Was Orlando was in Minnesota. Miami came in. Miami. Uh, well, Miami was already there when they were good because they were rivaling against the Knicks in Indiana yeah. and Chicago. They were good. So, yeah, no, Miami, that was way back with Miami. So New Orleans. But, yeah, the New Orleans, that's the one. It's just there's too many teams, so you can't catch up in a draft or trades to the really good teams. I hate it. Yeah, you got to get free It's agents. just flooded out. It's just too flooded out. Not enough talent to go around. That's yeah. the problem. Back then, yeah. you had depth. You had guys off the bench in all those sports. Played and, nine, ten guys. And they just, the hatred they played with, yeah. and they played like champions if they didn't win, you know? It's Nixon like, Heat, right? Nixon Bulls. Oh, those were great. Reggie Miller with Indiana, the yeah. Davis brothers. and It was just, that was my favorite era, that first half of the 90s. And yeah. then the, my favorite Knicks teams were the Allen Houston era. I oh, just, really? Late the, 90s? the Van Gundy era. Yeah. Better than, even though the Pat Riley, I liked the Xavier McDaniel, but the Van Gundy era was a good time. Yeah, they were. Anthony great. Mason, right? Yeah. Was and he the, Riley or was he Van Gundy or both? Uh, I'm not, probably both. He seems like a Pat Riley guy. John because Wallace. Because when Van Gundy came, yeah, Ewing was getting older, so he was coming off the beat bench, so they were more of a running team yeah. and stuff. And uh, they got screwed when they got in that fight against the Heat. Oh, was he was swinging Riley. off of Pat Riley, like... he knew what ticks him, because he was a psychology <laughs> name. Yeah, maybe from Floyd Ave. Came out freaking, what? He, was, he bought oh, on really? Floyd Ave. Yeah, uh, yeah, Pat Riley. Freaking Greg Anthony come out just... That's right. He's a punk, like the Back in the day, yeah. He the he's a good analyst, though. Yeah, like yeah, yeah. He's yeah, good. he's good. Yeah. All right, well, I got to run. All right, guy. Later. Good seeing you, bud. Yeah, buddy.